Hello everyone and welcome to the awesome adventurous world of Ginger Beyond the Crystal. This is a game available on Nintendo Switch now. Have I played it? No. Do I know anything about it? No. But what I do know is that we're going to do a Let's Play and see what this is all about. Wait, is that guy playing a Switch? Is that thing playing a Switch? <laughs> anyway, what's up, dudes and dudettes? Man, this is so cool. Right, we're going to be playing Ginger Beyond the Crystal today, so let's jump right in and check this game out. See what it's got to offer you. As you can see, I did start it once and then I completed 0%, so that tells you exactly how much I played this game. Um, I don't know. I'm a little old school, but we're going to go normal, just to check it out and if it's something that's doable there are yeah. many stories with great adventures in the fantasy kingdoms that's fantastic Some tell of small beings that showed great courage in difficult times like ginger okay there was once a pretty peaceful town every summer its inhabitants went into the heart of the forest where the magic is strongest taking gifts to their goddess, who inhabited a stone idol. It gave them great joy and happiness, and in return, she protected them with her light, bathing the pretty town in beauty and peacefulness. There was also a crystal next to the goddess's altar in the center of the forest. A huge, very powerful crystal. With its help, the goddess kept peace across the world through the connections with other crystals scattered around the town. The crystal was protected by three guardian druids down through the ages. And there they listened yes. to the goddess's voice. She told them of her desires, problems, and concerns until one day she stopped talking to them. The sudden silence was a great shock but soon after, a baby with large, kind eyes appeared at the foot of the altar, having been sent by the goddess to remind them that she would continue to protect the town and its inhabitants. The guardians cared for the baby in the heart of the forest, where the magic is strongest, and they called him Ginger. And although they no longer heard from the goddess, they knew that the child would be the voice and light that would guide them when difficult times came around. Years went by, and on one night, a strange character appeared in the forest, carrying a mysterious shiny crimson jewel. He slowly approached the forest goddess's altar before bowing and placing it next to the crystal. A terrible light then just want to say he looks just like Ginger before everything that was plunged into a horrible darkness. Oh no! Evil! <laughs> the goddess's crystal had lost its power. Its intense sky blue light became gloomy and pale, and it seemed to die. The goddess's power slowly dissipated. It's a long intro. So One maybe this game have a pretty good the story. The crystals in the towns broke, scattering fragments throughout the world. Their guardians looked on glumly as the crystal fragments disappeared over the horizon. Peaceful times were at an end. Chaos was approaching. not lost, however. The goddess spoke all of a sudden. She raised her voice and called little Ginger. His time had come. This is a long he must start his great adventure to save his brothers and bring a new dawn. That sounds like the end of that. There it is. Ginger beyond the crystal. We have to go not to the crystal and not, you can't get on the crystal. Don't get on the crystal now. Don't go to it. Ginger, you have to go beyond the crystal. 
Yeah. So, so you don't no, no, don't now, don't go to it now, Ginger. You got beyond, beyond the crystal, beyond, beyond the crystal. Not to it, not on it, beyond. <laughs> okay, here we go. Yeah. All right. So the environments look pretty cool. I will say that you know Ginger is kind of a weird name for this guy, but that's cool. Ginger, now that chaos has taken over the world, it's time to tell your story. Goody, goody. I brought you into this world in case it ever needed protection. Oni, that moment has arrived. You are the only one capable of putting a stop to all of this. The power of your guardians, the druids, wasn't enough, and they couldn't prevent chaos from invading your world. The crystals connecting me to this world have been corrupted. You must purify them so that my power returns to prevent chaos from advancing or everything in its path will be lost. I give you this power outfit so you can rid the world from... Should sugar douche <laughs> I like this. It's pretty awesome. Yeah. It's like a comfortable shirt where it shows my belly. Worthy of money. Okay, here we go. Let's, should we talk to these fellows? Uh, the camera's like backwards. Camera's backwards. Uh, let's look really quick and see. I can't do that right there, apparently. If I can turn on. Nope. I was gonna see if I could turn on the uh, subtitles. Okay. Kind of seems like they're automatically. Uh, 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 uh. Greetings, Ginger. My connection with the goddess informed me that you're aware of the difficult situation. I don't want to delay your mission, so I'll be brief. We know the goddess's power is stronger. Any other inhabitant in this world, so you can set off when you think you're ready. You know what? I'm just gonna like reject these. I'm gonna play. Yep. Thank you for applauding my decisiveness, but you didn't actually applaud, so that makes you a blue face liar. Okay. Yep. We got it. I said no. I said no. It says skip with a long line, like there's no button that does that. Is it is that minus? Is that is that what that is? It's totally minus. Ugh. I'm such a goober sometimes. Alright, so I, I guess maybe I'll get used to these controls. The camera up is down, down is up type deal. It doesn't look like I can fix it. Is there are no controls option, so we'll just make a make deal. We'll make it. We'll make do with it. All right, so we got a rush. We got a jump. We got a what looks like an uppercut. And that's it. So let's follow these lights. Lights, where will you lead me? I'm looking. Oh heck yeah! Looks like we're gonna fight these little cat bots. I'm a cat, meow, I want to stop you. Oh, it's not a cat. It just looked like a cat from a distance. It's more like Pinocchio. <laughs> I'm a real boy, and I'm going to stop you. <laughs> hey, shut, I'm, I'm a real boy, and you're just a blue creature. I'm a real boy. All right, so what are we doing here? Kame, Kame, ah! <laughs> Oh, oh man, alright, so it said to follow the lights and they went away, so let's go ahead and continue on, I suppose. Let's go to Blue Leaf Sign Town. Ginger, be on the crystal. Remember, don't get on the crystal. Do not get on the crystal. Do not go to the crystal, Ginger. You must go beyond the crystal. Remember, because the game will not finish. You cannot you cannot do what you're supposed to do, what you're created to do unless you go beyond that crystal. You must remember this. You can't yeah, now yes, don't don't go to the crystal. So what I am noticing here, even though I'm making fun, is that there is a little bit of a load. <clears throat> which seems 
very uh, uncharacteristic of Nintendo Switch games as of right now. So uh, maybe they could patch that to do something. I like the trees. I love the colors. Uh, and this, this is really cool. So. so we're in a town. It's got a crystal in the middle. And, uh, yeah, it's going to you know, be pretty cool. I'm feeling big and bad. I beat up Pinocchio a couple times. I just realized that my life is leaves. That's really cool. So I dig it. Ooh. 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 Oh. It's, it's so good to see you, Ginger. I knew the goddess would answer to this catastrophe. Don't stay there in the outskirts. Come with me. I'll tell you how things are in the town. <laughs> oh, oh, my back, my butt, oh, my legs. Everything was really chaotic after the crystal exploded. Look at our homes now. It's a disaster. A lot of the inhabitants were absorbed by the crystal after the explosion. There's not many of us left. Ooh. Hope and our faith in the goddess has kept us together, and our prayers have finally been answered. Ooh. It would be great to restore the connection to the portals and look for our most prominent inhabitants. You can leave the, the low-earning people behind. How are you? We lost all the energy crystals after the disaster, however. Rebuilding the town would be a great way to start. Well, here's some of what I collected. <laughs> Unbelievable! Today really is a great day! <laughs> yes! This is our crystal. It used to be connected to the druid's crystal, but now... <laughs> now... Oh, excuse me. Let's see if you can restore it by giving it energy. Give it some energy now. Give it the energy. Go on. Look at what you're doing there. Ginger, follow the light path to the portal. Follow the path now. Go on. I'm glad you found my mirror. I've been looking for it for the way you're going. I haven't talked to someone in weeks. <laughs> All right. So this is the Forest Chronicler. Let's check it out. So apparently I'm going to be going in some type of stages in order to uh, save these beings. That's pretty cool. So so far I like this game. Uh, it seems like the, I suppose you say the punch button, like the combat, is going to be way too loose. Uh, they need to really kind of tighten it up a little bit and make it, uh, I don't know, it may not be too bad. It's just when I was punching those Pinocchios earlier, it seemed like really loose and like it can be improved a little. The Forest Chronicler. There's some more of those Pinocchios. I'm a real boy. There's some more crystals that beat up. Yeah. And crystal. Beat you up. Okay. Let's check it out. Oh, what are you? Oh, I got it. I got him. I'm a real boy. <laughs> huh? I need fire for that. So I wonder if I like. By the way, you can't adjust the camera at all here. So this is like a kind of a locked, almost 2D. Help! Can anyone hear me? I'm the Chronicler. Come and get me. I'm a real boy. <laughs> oh man! Come on, let me spin them to you. Okay, so apparently we got choices. Let's go this way first. You're going the wrong way, rescue me! Is this a save point? All 
Alrighty, save today. Anyway, well that's going to do it for this Let's Play. I hate to stop now. I mean, what's going to happen to the Cronkler? I don't know. If you want to find out, maybe you have to, you know, pick up this game. It seems pretty good, you know? So far, so good. And uh, I like it. The colors are great. It's kind of like an N64-ish style game. I've had fun so far and I can't wait to play it some more. So, anyway, that's going to do it for this Let's Play, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe below. And remember, for all things awesome, come right here to GameStore.